Hello, I am Mary Majesty Cruz. Welcome to my hometown, Pauai! First stop, the world famous Pauai Church. This religious feature nestling in the northern part of Luzon, Philippines, is the unparalleled symbol of being a true Ilocana and also to the rich cultural heritage of the Ilocanas. This church is one of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites in the world. It was finished under the Spanish regime in 1710 and survived six major earthquakes in the Philippine history. Its walls are made of large coral stones in the lower part and bricks on the upper levels. And take note, this church was composed of 24 buttresses. Next destination, voila! Let's head to Malacanang of the North, also known as Malacanang Te Amyanan. Tara! This presidential museum was the residence of the family of the late former Philippine President Ferdinand E. Marcos. Adjacent to it is the magnificent Pauay Lake, also known as Dakkel Adanum, the largest natural lake in the area, measuring 470 hectares. Planning to go to China? That's not a problem. We bring China to you. Wan Ying! This newest tourist attraction here in our province is located here in Pawai, just beside the Malacanang of the North. Xie Xie Ni, Sai and arduous trip, obey your stomach. Welcome to Kamarin Cafe!
na imas our local rice cake. Just a trivia, we call it the doll when it's set and binugbog when it's set. That's just a foretaste of what Pawai could really offer. Oops! This is actually free when we celebrate Guling Guling Festival a day before Ash Wednesday. See ya! Pawai Church is a Pawai Sanju who would have thought that we bring the Middle East to the northern part of the Philippine Islands. Amusements and delight, that's not a problem. Once you have finally decided to take the adventure, brace yourself for a bumpy dumpy but also fun 4x4 ride. In Tayan! And never get homesick when you spend your day together with your loved ones. Till we meet again, see ya!